All right, guys, welcome. We're gonna talk about Yamamoto. I don't personally know this character, so like it's kind of weird. Um, yeah, I mean, I didn't expect this character to be a five star. I don't. I didn't think a lot of people know this character. You know, uh, anyway, I don't know him. So like, but yeah. Um, let's go into the moves. Maybe he's like good. You know, right? But yeah. Um, his skill, heat wave. You know. It's got AOE, like a really big AOE actually. That's 50 damage, 15 second cooldown, that's fine. Rapid Inferno is like um, short range slashes in front of you, like you can't really move while using it, so... Yeah, um... And third one, Flame Eruption, it makes like um, Like a pillar, like many pillars in front of you, basically. It's like a big explosion, kind of. Picks up straight in front of you. And Fiery Lance... You know, uh, you just gotta see the cooldown and damage. It basically, yeah, it's just what it does, you know. Dash forward, release fire impact. Yeah, basically it knocks people back. Like, we're getting a lot of knockback moves. Like, let's try the Lance, right? Yeah, it, it, he kind of got flung. Just not the way we think it would. So, let's try Heat Wave. You know, first move. That AoE is very big. It does a lot of damage, you know. Highest damage move. So the cooldown is like super average though, and then the ramp inferno, like you can't move. I'm. I was pressing WASD. Yeah, you can move. You, you can kind of change direction. I don't know the character. I don't think a lot of people's gonna like him. Like him like, I don't think an old man is cool enough, unless you just want to meme or something. The guy wants to talk. What's up? They just say like, I don't know. Let, let's look at Robo chat. Oh, uh, he said hi, I think. Cool, you know. But yeah, let's check out the third move. But yeah, it's like a super large long range AoE. It did like half that damage. This is alright, you know. Like, most of these moves aren't gonna one shot the Sand Ninja besides Heat Wave and Fiery Lance, right? And if you're playing this game, you're probably gonna farm Sand Raid right now, since it's currently, you know, the best, best raid right now for gold and like you know it depends how you farm really but yeah it's all right everybody's trying out yamamoto right now like he's out on the roll so i mean i, I don't know if i like him i i, I don't know I, I gotta say this man guys like old man i don't think i'm gonna like him but we're gonna you know see maybe his move is different you know in sand raid and i love them to level 10 right because that's the average level for like fighting sand raid if you're at sand you're at least close to level 10, I feel like. Or like, you know, right? At least level your kick a little bit. If you're using level 1, you're probably not going to survive. But right now, Yamamoto seems like an average 5 star. Like, nothing special, nothing crazy, you know? He's just kind of there for no reason. Even though his moves are super cool. Like, I do like it a lot. Like, the effects. Okay, it doesn't one-shot them, which is not good. So I, I don't think we want to invest into him just because like his moves are all damaged. There's no utility or anything to back him up when he's standing still and using his move like watch. Like if something comes behind me, I'm kinda like dead, you know? Which is not good, you know. It's not what we're looking for in a unit, you know. But his left click does do all how much is that actually? We didn't test that out, my bad guys. But he Seems to do a lot of left click damage, maybe the staff um, question mark. Uh, weird, weird. But yeah, your average five star, you know, does a lot of damage. You know? But we should really gather him up and like use one. He's like a budget white bear kinda. You can kind of use him like white bear or like any other character in the middle, and just use heat wave every time to get it. Get here, you know, right? So that's not bad. They can jump over that. Okay, Rapid, Inferno, it's bad. They can jump over the move, so no point using it. So, um, Flame Eruption, it doesn't one-shot, right? Let's try. Yeah, we tried that earlier, it didn't one-shot. So the only thing that one-shot is Heat Wave, so... At an average level 10, Heat Wave is probably gonna be the best move. But yeah, 
Alright, just so far it seems alright guys, like, I don't think he's gonna do crazy amount or anything anytime soon, so he's alright, you know. You want a meme or something, I guess you could always try this character, you know. This seems like a valid option. Auto Fiery Lance is pretty good for a finisher, you know, besides the, like knockback and stuff. You can use it to finish someone off, you know. Did I just like block? Okay, did Heat Wave block the rock? Hold up. Can they sh shoot Kunai at me real quick, guys? Come on. Mmm, they didn't shoot. Damn, they shot it after. I think the, um, I think the Inferno blocked their projectile back there. Cause like the rock didn't hit, even hit me, so... I'm not talking about that one. It just hit me. God damn it. <laughs> damn. It'd be like that. Come on, man. But yeah, heat wave. Oh, wait, it doesn't one shot the fat one, so level 11 might be better for this guy. So you can one shot the fat minion or the tank, you know? You get it. But yeah, level 11 would probably be the best for sand raid if you want to do that. Yeah, if you want to use this guy for sand raid. So this is AoE is pretty good, you know? It's like, eh, hey, I'm tired of white bear, you know? You can go this guy. But yeah, super average for a 5 star, I feel like. Nothing crazy. But yeah, let's just get through this. I don't know what to say, man. Heat wave, you know, yeah, amazing. Yeah, all of them does like knockback besides the rapid inferno. Which makes this character kinda bad, you know. I don't like knockback in my moves. Unless it does high damage like white bear. Well then again, my unit is not that low though. But yeah, it's fine, right? It's fine. Okay, like, come on, throw rocks at me, man. He didn't throw rocks, man. Now he throws- Oh, come on. Bro. Alright, wave 10. Well, like usual, you know, we're gonna clean up the normal. I just heat wave, because it's efficient, you know? And bop. Alrighty. Okay, let's use Lance. After our cooldown, so when he grabs us up, we can just use it. Okay, that hurt. That hit him. Okay, okay. The range hit him as well. Okay, let's get up closer to him. Now, oh god, that's so loud actually. Wait, where'd he go? Yeah, the knockback is really bad. He just grabbed at me again. Okay. One, two, three. Yeah, he's like super average for a five star, really. You expect more from a five star, but right now he's super average. Like there are better units, definitely. Like that has high OE, AOE, like Asta, Whitebeard, maybe Madara. Madara does like he's like average cooldown, average damage, so pretty balanced. I feel like I haven't really like looked into him too much, but. Yeah, there's not much to say for Yamamoto, you know, like, he's cool, like, the moves are cool, like, for sure, right, the, why was he made a 5 star, right, uh, can we talk about this, why was he made a 5 star, I mean, like, legendary, right, who decided to make him a legendary, bro, like, I know the moves are good and all, but, like, I don't think the character is popular enough to be a 5 star or legendary, it's like the same thing with Kenpachi, I don't feel like people know him enough, like, I know, like, everybody knows who ich Ichigo is, right? Like, from Bleach, right? Everybody know, but, like, then why is he, like, uncommon, you know? What the hell? Main character's uncommon, bro? Like, Luffy, man? I don't... Like, oh, I don't know, man. Like, there are so many more characters that could be legendary. I, I don't know what they were thinking, you know? I just trying to make, like, the game somewhat unique and different. Have, like, bad 5 stars. I don't know what was the plan, but, like... Yeah, uh, guys, guys, I, I don't know. Let me know what you think in comments, I guess. Like, this hurts my brain, bro. Like, the more I think about it, of why you should add Yamamoto into this game, the more I think that you shouldn't. Like, if, if, if we're gonna add him, you might as well, like, just make him, like, rare at most, you know? Like, I don't really get it. But anyways, you know, thank you guys for watching. 
I'm gonna have out for the day. This is super weird, man. Yamamoto, he's very average. Oh, yeah.